You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and I get to try a Chase's Cherry Mash from St. Joseph, Missouri. And this is two ounces of something. I don't know just yet. I've never had it, you know. It's sad to say I haven't had any, every kind of candy out there. And I've tried a lot of candy, right? You've seen a lot of the videos. It says an American favorite since 1918. How come I've never had it before? So here's how taking your cherry mash and making a cherry mash milkshake. Put in blender one cherry mash cut into small pieces, three fourths cup cold milk, two scoops vanilla ice cream, chocolate syrup to taste, blend and enjoy. Now that tastes really good. Actually, that sounds really tasty. I don't know what I was saying there. Cherry mash sundae. Melt two cherry mash bars with two tablespoons milk. While still warm, pull over vanilla ice cream. Serves five or six. Visit website cherrymash.com. Aha, some more information. Manufactured by Chase Candy Company. Questions or comments, please write to us. Now, what's in a cherry mash? I'm not sure. Is it going to be actual cherries, or is it going to be some kind of combination? Let me just zoom out a little bit there. Here we go. We're all seeing this for the first time. Well, maybe not some of you. Ooh, look at that. It's like a, a, a log, a chocolate chunk of log or something. Mmm. Let me sniff that. It's got a very heavy cherry taste. Here, let me get my new plate in here. Is this worthy of dissection? I mean, this is, dare I say, this is what I live for? Do I live for dissecting candy? I... Well, look at it. It's just calling out to me to cut me. And I'm thinking it's going to, I don't know. Well, here we go. First layer, not too hard to get through. And now, we're opening it up, and inside, ooh, interesting. That is the cherry mash. That's a pretty color inside a candy. Let's just, let's touch it. Oh, it's like, it's like a Play-Doh almost. Let's eat it. Mmm. Super cherry tasting. I gotta cut this a little smaller. I could see why now this would be good in a milkshake or melted on ice cream. All right, I'm gonna eat this piece. Say goodbye. Well, I didn't show you the whole bottom of it. Here we go. Now the chocolate is soft. I'm not sure what these little nuggets are in here. They don't offer a resistance to my teeth. So I'm not feeling any crunch at all. You think, look at that, it's like a, like a rock, like a giant chocolate rock. You would think this exterior would offer some crunch, but it doesn't. That's a pretty unique looking candy. 1918 they've been making these, wow. Where have I been? Yeah, so I just ate the outside. And like I said, nothing crunchy. And the, the chocolate, although you're eating it, I'm almost thinking that's coconut maybe. Little chunks of coconut, not sure. But this cherry center really um, overpowers the chocolate. So you're getting a lot of cherry with a little, you know, chocolate taste to it. I'm going to have to try one of these. I'm going to have to get more of these and do this cherry mash milkshake. Wouldn't that be fun to watch? All right, well, there you go. That's a cool one. And thanks for, uh, you know, sticking around as I dissect it. It's really appreciated. And if you want to see more candies like this, look in the description for a playlist or search our channel. Later. If you want to find this item, click the link in the description area below the video. You can also watch more videos in this series by clicking here. Thanks for watching. And always remember, if you see a lucky penny, pick it up.